What's up, everybody, and welcome back. We've got a special Mighty Monday workout for y'all today. My name is Corey, and I am your Planet Fitness Trainer. Now, with this year and everything going on and the holidays coming up, we're going to be talking about some simple ways to incorporate positive reinforcement and reducing stress in our everyday lives. Now, I'm so excited that y'all could be here with me today. Remember, whether you're in club or at home, no matter where you're at, you can get this workout done. If you are in the club, please remember we've got our team cleaning for y'all around the clock 24 seven so that you always go and do a squeaky clean club. Now we're in our 360 area today. We've got a core workout for y'all, body weight, five exercises and a circuit. And I will provide modifications along the way if you do need it. Now, first things first here, let's get right into this warm up. All right, so we're gonna start off. We're gonna go right into a squat stance here and we're gonna go down, touch our toes, breathe in at the bottom, breathe out at the top. All right, awesome job. Remember, as always, find your own pace. Whatever works for you, breathe in at the bottom. Breathe out at the top, whatever feels good. Breathe in and breathe out. Hands can go on the hips here, just going across the body. Breathe in whenever feels good for you. Breathe in and breathe out. One more time here, y'all. Nice job. All right, we're gonna narrow that stance out. We're gonna go into a step back with a knee drive up and step back down. Step back and do a little knee drive and foot back down. I'll go to the side here so you can see me. You don't have to step back too far here, y'all. Whatever feels good for you, breathe in and breathe out. Awesome. All the way through here, we're gonna do this for a few seconds. Just a nice, easy pace. Your depth is totally up to you. Whatever feels good, breathe in. We're gonna do a few more. Breathe out, I'll come back to center here. Do a few more so you can see me. Breathe in and breathe out. Last one, come up, nice job. Hands on the hips here. We're gonna get the core nice and warmed up. We're just gonna go into some really easy hip circles here. We're gonna go both ways. We're gonna do this direction for just a few seconds here. Breathe at your own pace. Big deep breaths in through the nose, out through the mouth. Nice job, all the way through. Big circles, get those hips nice and opened up. All right, y'all. And we're gonna bounce back and go the other way. Big breaths in. Big breaths out. Nice job. All the way through. All right, nice job here. Now we're gonna go through that round one more time just to make sure we're nice and warmed up. All right, so we're already in that squat stance. Hands can stay on the hips and breathe out. And we're gonna go down, touch those toes. Now, if you can't do that, you can always just go down to the knee here. Hinge at that hip, really good job. All right, I'll kind of go from the side so you can see me here. Breathe in and breathe out, breathe in and breathe out. I'm gonna go a little deeper and touch my toes here. Remember, do whatever range of motion you can do, whatever feels comfortable all the way through. We're gonna do a few more here, y'all. Nice job. All right, so hands can stay on the hips here. We're gonna go into the step back and drive that knee up, step back, and drive that knee up. Nice job, y'all, all the way through. I'll come back to center here, take a step, and breathe. Nice job, take a little step, and breathe. We're gonna do a few more. Nice job. All right, back down, open that stance up. We're gonna go into our hip circles again here. We're gonna go this direction for a few seconds, and then we're gonna go right back in the other and get into this workout. Remember to keep breathing all the way through. Just good habit builders, all right? Three, two, one. All right, we're gonna bounce back. Go the other direction here, y'all. Nice, smooth movements here all the way through. Big breaths in through the nose. Big hip circles here, a few more. All right, three, two, one, and that's time. All right, now before we start this workout, some simple ways to incorporate positive reinforcement into our lives is saying positive things, something that I like to do before I go and tackle anything in my day. Things like I am strong, resilient, smart. I can do all things. Take that energy and put it into your workout. Let me know in the comments something that you might say to yourself to hype you up. All right, now let's get right into this workout. So we're going to start with our core. All right, so we're going to go into some toe touches. So my feet are going to go up. I'm gonna have my hands by my shoulders. I'm gonna breathe in and I'm gonna breathe out. Breathe in and I'm gonna breathe out. All right, if you need to, you can drop those feet down and you can reach. 
Just really good breathing here, crunch, and really concentrate on activating those abdominals. All right, we're gonna breathe in, open those arms up, stretch the abs, and then breathe and contract. Now my feet can be up, like I was saying here. All right, we're gonna do a few more. Let's do one more big breath in, breathe out. Feet are gonna come back down. We're gonna work on the obliques. So now we're gonna go into some heel touches here. All right, y'all, nice job. Remember, find a point that feels good for you for breathing. Breathe in, keep that nose working in, in and out, out through the mouth, all the way through nice and smooth here. You can lay your head down if you need to. That will take some tension off your neck. Nice, smooth motions here, just crunching those obliques all the way through. All right, a few more here, y'all. Three, two, one, and that's time. Nice job. All right, so now the foot's gonna come up on top of this knee here. My arm with the same leg will stay down, and we're gonna crunch across the body, just hitting that whole abdominal plane. Breathe in at the bottom. Nice breath out at the top. All right, we're gonna do a few of those here. And breathe out. Keep breathing all the way through. Extremely important with the core exercise, y'all, to keep breathing, getting those abs working, all right? We're gonna do a couple more. Breathe in, breathe out. Nice job, we're gonna switch. Other leg will come up to the top. That arm will come down, and we're gonna go the other direction here, y'all. Breathe in, and breathe out. Nice job. Go at your own pace, take a break if you need it, whenever you do, and just jump right back in with me, all right? Y'all are doing so good. Nice here, three, two, one more. Awesome, so now we're gonna go into the lower abs. You can put your hands down to your side. If you need some extra support for your back, those hands can go underneath your tailbone here, and we've got some flutter kicks, nice and smooth. All right, y'all, really good breathing all the way through. Remember, whatever pace works for you, in through the nose, out through the mouth, all the way through, y'all. Big deep breaths in. If you need to take some tension off, you can always drop the feet to the floor and raise them up individually, one at a time. All right, y'all are doing so good. All right, remember we can pick this pace up and keep these moving. That'll really activate and get that tension going. We're gonna do a few more here, a few more seconds. Three, two, one, and that's time. All right, so I'm gonna come up here. We're gonna start out in kind of a plank position. We're gonna be on all fours. My hands are under my shoulders. My knees are under my hips. We're going to get a plank reach. My right leg and my left arm will reach, and we're breathing. All right, really good for core stability here, y'all. Reach with the opposite leg and opposite arm, and we wanna hold that and breathe for a few seconds. And breathe, nice job, y'all. Doing really good, nice smooth pace. We're holding that for a few seconds. Big breath in when you're out at the bottom. And breathe out and really extend through those arms and those toes and stretch that body out and get that core really working. All right, y'all, one more here. Hold and come back down. Nice job, that's one of our circuits here. We got five exercises, remember? So I'm gonna take a little break here. Y'all take it too if you want. We're gonna get a little bit of water. All right, remember take a break as long as you need it. All right, we got four rounds of these, so we got one down. We're gonna start over again here, all right? So we're gonna go back into our toe touches. So feet are gonna start back up here at the top. Hands are gonna get extended, open them up slightly, and breathe, and we're reaching. All right, y'all, everyone's doing really good here. We're killing this workout. Really smooth movements all the way through. Breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, and breathe out. Awesome job. Remember, you can drop those feet down and focus on just that really good crunch and abdominal contraction. All right, breathe in with a big breath out. Remember, you can make these harder or easier if you need to. Go at your own pace. One more here. All right, so now my feet are already down, so we're gonna stay here, and we're gonna go back to working the obliques. We're gonna go into some heel touches. My heels are tucked into my backside. My head is up to keep my abdominals activated all the way through here, y'all. Keep breathing in through the nose, and out through the mouth. Nice job. 
nice smooth motions all the way through. Always go at your own pace and just reach whatever your range of motion will allow. All I'm doing is just tapping the backside of my heel seal, y'all. All right. Okay, one more reach, and we're gonna go into our crossbody crunches. So that knee is gonna come up. Our foot's gonna go on top of that. Same leg and armor down. We're gonna open these up and breathe. Big breath in and breathe out, all right? Go whatever your pace will allow, your range of motion. If you can't make that all the way to the knee there, that's totally cool. You just crunch to whatever you can do. Go at your own pace. Take a break if you need it and hop right back in with me. All right, we're gonna do a couple of more here. Big breath in, last one on this side, and breathe. Awesome job. Now we're gonna switch so this arm will go down, right leg will come up, and we're gonna crunch across the body here, y'all. Nice smooth range of motion, just going across that whole abdominal section here. We're working everything today, all right? Nice big breath in, and breathe out all the way through. All right, we got a couple more here, y'all. One, two, all right. So now we're gonna get into the lower abs. Remember, hands are down. If you need that support, hands will go underneath to support your tailbone. You can definitely put your head back here if you need to. You can always keep that up. Keep those abdominals engaged all the way through. All right, nice job. Remember, if you need to make these easier, one at a time here, we'll take some of that tension away. Make that a little bit easier. Find a good breathing point here. All the way through, breathe in and breathe out, and that will help you go. Keep that oxygen flowing all the way through. Nice job, we're gonna do a few more. I'm gonna pick that up right there at the end. Three, two, one. Awesome job, all right. So now we're gonna go back into your plank reach here. All right, so we're stacked on all fours, and we're gonna reach opposite arm and leg, all right? Reach and breathe. We're gonna breathe in here, reach and breathe out. Nice smooth motions here, we're holding these making that core really work and stabilize our bodies so we can work on our balance a little bit as well. And breathe out, breathe in, and breathe out. Nice job here, y'all. We're gonna do a few more. Reach and breathe. Awesome job. Let's do one more. Breathe in. Big breath out and come back to center. Now that's two rounds. We're halfway through, y'all. That's definitely something to smile about, all right? One of the easiest ways to help reduce some stress is a smile, and it improves your mood. Let's take that, your friends, your family, your workout partner, keep smiling throughout the rest of this workout, all right? I'm gonna get another drink of water here before we, before we start. All right, so we're on round three here. Okay, so we're gonna go right back to our toe, touch, toe touches. So we're gonna bring these up, breathe in, and breathe out, all right? Awesome job, y'all. Y'all doing so good. We're getting there. We're moving and grooving. All right, all the way through. Keep breathing. That's gonna keep you moving, all right? Breathe in and breathe out. Remember to go at your own pace. If you need to make these easier, drop those feet down. Breathe in and crunch. Y'all are doing so good. Awesome job here. Keep breathing in. Big breath out. Toes can come up to make this harder. All right, we're gonna do a few more. Breathe in. That awesome job. One more here, y'all, and breathe. All right, feet come straight down. We're gonna tuck them in. We're working the obliques. Okay, so we're gonna go right back into our heel touches here. My head is up to kind of help keep my abs engaged. If you need to drop that head down and relieve some of that tension, no big deal, y'all. You'll go at your own pace, okay? Find your own pace for breathing as well. Whatever feels good for y'all. Big breath in through the nose and breathe out. I'm just touching the back of my heels here just to get those obliques nice and fired up. All right, we're gonna do a few more here. Three, two, one on each side counts. All right, so now we're gonna go across the body here. Same leg is up, arm is down. We're gonna crunch across the body here. Breathe in and breathe out. Remember your range of motion is totally up to you. If you can't go all the way to that knee, no big deal, just get that crunching motion in across the body to really get those upper abdominals fired up. All right, big breath in and open up. We got a couple more here to do. Three, two, one more, and we're gonna switch, all right? Other leg goes down, 
leg goes on the top, my other arm is down to my side, hand is right by my head, and we're gonna crunch across the body here, all right? Y'all are doing so good. Remember, take breaks when you need them, get water if you need it, and keep on breathing all throughout the workout that'll keep you moving, all right? So I'm gonna big breath in here at the bottom, I'm gonna breathe out, and I'm gonna crunch. Awesome job, so we're gonna do a couple more here. Three, two, one, last one. All right, so go right back into those lower abdominals. Remember, hands are to the side, underneath if you need that support. We got flutter kicks here, so my head is down to relieve some of that tension. If you wanna engage those abdominals, the head can come up just to make that a little bit harder. All right, find your own pace for breathing, whatever works for you all the way through. Now I'm gonna just kinda show you how to make this easier here. Just put those feet on the ground, do one at a time, just to relieve some of that tension here, all right? We got a few more seconds. Keep moving, y'all are doing so good. Deep breaths in. And breathe out, last few seconds here. Keep those smooth, toes are pointed all the way through here, y'all. Three, two, one, awesome job. We're gonna go right back into our planks here. Plank reaches, hands are down, knees are under our hips. Opposite arm and leg, breathe out, hold for a couple of seconds, and then come back down. Breathe in, breathe out, hold for a couple of seconds, and come back down, all right? We're gonna do a few of these here. Breathe out, breathe in, and breathe out. Hold that just for a few seconds to make sure those stabilizer muscles are working. Nice job, y'all. We're gonna do a couple more here. Big breath out and hold. Nice job, one more, reach, come back down. Awesome, take a little break here, y'all. That's round three. We got one more to go, y'all are doing so good here. Got one more, we're gonna make it, all right? Here we go, we're into our last one. All right, so we're gonna go right back where we started. Feet are up here, arms are extended. We're gonna breathe in with the arms coming back and breathe out and reach. I'm really breathing here. It's really important to help engage those abdominal muscles. Breathe in and breathe out. If you wanna make those easier, drop those feet down, open that up, and just focus on that contraction with your crunch. Breathe in and big breath out. Nice job, y'all. Doing so good all the way through. If you wanna turn these up, legs come up here. Nice job. We're gonna do a few more. All right, three, two, one. All right, so right back to the obliques, okay? On the side here, feet are tucked in, and we're just gonna reach right to our heels here. Find your own pace for breathing. Big breath in through the nose, and out through the mouth. Nice job, y'all, all the way through here. Keep moving with me, we're almost there. We've made it, all right? Three, two, one. All right, so now we're gonna go into our crossbody crunches. Foot comes up on top of the knee, my arm is down, and I'm gonna crunch my elbow and opposing knee together here just to hit all across that abdominal section, all right? Nice job, breathe in at the bottom, breathe out and crunch. Nice job, everybody's doing so good. Remember to go at your own pace and take breaks when you need them, all right? We got a few more on this side, three, two, one more. All right, big breath out, and we're gonna switch. Other foot's gonna come up, arm is gonna stay down on the opposite side, and we're breathing. All right, nice job, y'all. Breathe in, and breathe out. Go to whatever your range of motion will allow. If you can't go all the way to that knee, that's okay. Just crunch across that body as best as you can. All right, we've got a couple more here, three, two, one, nice job, all right? So we're gonna go right back and finish with our lower abdominals here. We got the flutter kicks, hands are to your side if they're harder, underneath for more support for your back, all right? So my head's gonna start off down, just to kinda keep that tension away as much as possible here. If you wanna engage those abdominals even more, the head comes up and you'll really feel that tension activate here. Nice, smooth, open motions here, all right? If you need to make those a little bit easier, feet go down, raise these up, one at a time. All right, y'all doing so good here. Big deep breaths. 
Remember, whatever suits you, whatever feels good. All right, we're almost there, we're almost finished. All right, I'm gonna go back and turn these up again here. Nice big flutter kicks, open those hips up. All right, three, two, one, and that's time. All right, so we're gonna go into our planks here to finish off with this, all right? We're gonna put on opposite arm and leg, reach and breathe, all right? Breathe in, reach and breathe out, reach and breathe out and hold that for just a couple of seconds here. We're working on that core balance, y'all. Nice job. Breathe in here. And breathe out all the way through. Breathe in. And breathe out. All right, our last one here. And breathe out. All right, y'all, nice job. You finished that workout. So we're gonna go into our cool down here first. Now I'm already on my mat. Okay, so we're gonna go into a few stretching exercises, which is one of my favorite ways to help reduce some stress as well. Focus on your breathing and just focus on you and your mind and body connection. Okay, so we're gonna start off with some cat and camels. So we're in the same position we just finished on with our planks here. All right, so we're gonna open that back up with a big breath in, and then we're gonna lower that down with a big breath out. All right, nice smooth motions here, y'all. No rush at all, big breath in and big breath out. This is all about relaxing and feeling good. Get in the moment here. Big breath in. And breathe, all right? So now we're gonna go into a lower back stretch. You're gonna fall back. You're gonna lean back on your thighs. You're gonna focus on that stretch here. All right, and then we're gonna come up and fall onto the arms. And as far as whatever you can go down, we're stretching out our chest and our shoulders and our abdominals, our lower back. Everything feels really good right now. Big breaths in. And big breaths out. We're gonna go back into that child's pose stretch. Hold that just for a couple of seconds. We're to come right back down into this upper dog stretch here. Good breathing all the way through. Big breath in, big breath out. All right, last one here. We're gonna finish on those cat and camels. Big breath in. Big breath in, one more here. And big breath out. All right, y'all. Awesome job today on finishing the workout. Way to finish and keep up with me all the way through. Now, last point here on reducing that stress is to slow down and focus on some time for you. You just crush that workout. So go treat yourself to your favorite food, watch your favorite shows, read that book that you've been wanting to read, or simply hang out with your friends and your family. Do something that makes y'all happy today. All right, now we've got all of our other awesome trainers here for y'all. Monday through Friday to keep y'all moving throughout the week. Don't forget to download that Planet Fitness app for more content like our crowd meter, exercises, and tons for our machines. Thanks for joining me. My name is Corey. Have an awesome day.